All right, there are previous Lubavitcher Rebbe, there's two types of laws. Laws that create life and laws that are created by life. <clears throat> right? Every country has their laws. Human laws are created by life. This thing is somewhere. Why, why is the camera not responding over here? Okay. <clears throat> uh, you don't have to see me, right? One second. One second. Maybe you do here. One second. Put this here. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. There are, there are two types of statues. There are statues which, are, which create life, and there are statues which are created by life. Human laws are created by life. So human laws vary from place to place. One second. They vary from place to place. So the law from land to land, according to the circumstances, right? The laws by the Eskimos are different from the laws of, of you know, the Russians. And the, it's according to the, to the, how do you say, the, the necessities and the, the, the vicissitudes of life. But God's Torah is a Torah that creates life. And what's God's Torah is the Torah of truth. It's the same in all places at the same in all times. The Torah is eternal. And those, all the different religions are usually according to the people who make these religions up. You have a person that's not religious, the person that is religious, right? Basically, the laws are, <clears throat> the people are basically the same. <clears throat> <clears throat> not the case of Judaism. In Judaism, <clears throat> the Torah tells us what life is. We don't dictate to the Torah what is convenient and what is good and what is proper, right? <clears throat> <clears throat> Therefore, the Torah is eternal, unchanging, and tells us what life is. Okay. All right, let's do a story. Here we have a story. Hurry today, here we go. Um, 